What's going on everybody, Mike McIntyre here back with a brand new video, first video of 2023. And this one is a special one because it took me a while to work out this particular scenario in 2022, but I'm finally pumped to bring you guys a review of the red white apparel bib shorts. So let's get into this brand new video. Before we begin, you guys know the drill. Please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification, take care of all those things, and then let's get into this review. So this video is brought to you by Red White Apparel. I found these guys online in 2022, and I reached out because I was very interested in reviewing their bib shorts. They're a company that focuses specifically on designing and manufacturing bib shorts. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit about them, then we're gonna review them, we're gonna jump down on the bike on the trainer, and I'll tell you a little bit more about the performance of these particular bib shorts. So these are the brand new bib shorts. These are made by a company called Red White Apparel. And I reached out to them early in 2022 and the owner and only employee of the company is named Yuva. He runs the business himself. They're based out of Singapore and they've been around since 2014. Now initially they actually manufactured several products but as time went on they noticed that they really wanted to focus on the bib shorts, something that is very, very important in road cycling, something that can be, honestly, it can make or break your ride. They're very important to fit properly. You want the right amount of comfort, you want the right amount of performance out of these things so that you can ride for hours on end and really perform at a high level. So bib shorts are extremely important. At this present time, they make three models, a couple for men and a couple for women, and I'm gonna tell you about their most common model called, simply called the bib. So let's get into the review of these bib shorts right here. These are the bib shorts. Now, when I was speaking to Yuva, it's very, very important that you get your sizing right. So he was extremely big on getting the right measurements. So during our email discussions, he asked me my measurements, my height, my weight, um, waist circumference, thigh circumference, all kinds of things to really dial in the fit. And there is a new model out that I'll tell you about. So we did send out a few different models so that I could review a few different ones and tell you about how they fit. So Red White Apparel came out with a new model of the bib. It's still called the bib, but they offer it as a standard bib or as a bib with a five centimeter shorter inseam in each size. So if you have um, a large like me, you can get the shorter inseam so that you would fit your legs properly or you can go for the standard length. Now, I've tried both on and in my opinion, I prefer the standard length bib short. I don't necessarily need the shorter inseam because I like them to be just above the knee. So for me, the standard length standard bib is the model that I would go for. But if you are even shorter than I am and you know, you're know you a little bit heavier or you're a little bit of a bigger build, you have the option now to fit into your proper size bib short without them being too long. So that is a great design idea on their part. Now let's review the bib as they call it. It's just called the bib. It only comes in black. You really can't go wrong with a, just an all black bib short. It's made from Italian Lycra and there are all kinds of really cool components that I'll go over before we jump down on the trainer. So the first thing that makes a pair of bib shorts really, really important obviously is the pad. So this is a four step pad. It is heat molded, thermal molded to create a really unique, um, a, a unique feel, a really nice pad. So you can see that here. You have high density foam, low density foam. You have a bacterial liner to keep it clean as well as a perforated material so that it breathes and it can keep you comfortable. So in my first couple of rides, I have ridden in them already. The pad has been excellent. I'm very, very impressed with the pad. It doesn't chafe, it doesn't rub. So the padding is a very, very high quality. Around the cuff of the leg right here, you can see there's a little bit of a different stitching pattern. So the final two inches here is a specific cuff. It has a little bit more of that kind of microfiber feel to it or, or a textile material. And there are these little rubber uh, perforations here. Well, they're not perforations. There's these little rubber grippers here along the cuff of the leg so that the shorts don't ride up. Now, once you start riding, the shorts will naturally fall into their place, but once they fall in place, those little rubber elements will keep the, the, the cuff and the shorts from riding up and preventing any kind of chafing. So the cuff is something that I really like. I like the way that fits. I'm a huge fan of the chamois. There is a little RW logo that's kind of stitched on here. It's like a rubber 
stamp almost that's stitched onto the leg. That's the only branding that you're gonna find on the shorts themselves. The bib straps are another thing that they've absolutely nailed in my opinion. I've tried enough bib shorts now to know what fits well and what doesn't. These ones, they come up all the way up the back as you can see and they are completely made out of mesh which is great and I like the width. They're not too thin, they're not too narrow, but they're not too wide either. I've definitely seen some that are almost too wide. These ones are probably about an inch, maybe an inch and a half wide and they are the perfect length in my opinion. Let's send it down to the trainer, let's get on the bike and we'll ride in them to show you how they perform. I just wanted to give you a quick summary of the red white apparel bib shorts. So again, these ones are just called the bib. I'm wearing my standard large size, but the regular version. Because I like the shorts to sit a little bit longer, I find the five centimeter shorter model to be too short for my liking. Once you start riding, the shorts kind of fall naturally into their, I guess, natural position. The rubber elements underside, on the underside of the cuff here help them from, from riding, but once once you start moving, like I said, I'm bending my knee now, my legs are moving, the shorts find that natural position. So the shorter model for me, if I'm on the bike, would be like up here, which I personally find, it'd be like removing the cuff. It'd be like this, and I find that too short. My preference is to have a longer bib short to begin with, so I find the standard model to be my preferred fit, and the size large is the correct size for me. Not quite as tight, as the Castelli race fit ones, but still offering that kind of performance, you know, tight hugging fit, just not at the same tightness as Castelli, if you will. So, um, super impressed, really high quality. I love the chamois. The chamois fits really, really well. And um, yeah, honestly, great product. Great, great pair of bib shorts. If you're interested in trying something different because it's not a you know a super well-known brand like Sportful or Castelli or you know Santini, some of these big names in the cycling world. If you want to try something new, I highly, highly recommend them. They are an excellent product. The chamois is excellent, the fit is really, really well done. And if you're concerned about your fit, you're gonna get unmatched customer service from Yuva. They'll help you find your fit and um, yeah, it's just a really, really good buying experience. So let's send it back up to the desk and wrap the video up. So there you have it guys, that's my review of the Red White Apparel, the bib, the bib shorts designed by Red White Apparel. Absolutely 100% impressed with them. I'm very, very happy with the quality. I think you will be too. If you're looking for a, a bib short that really just specializes in getting the proper fit, this is the model to go for. They are very, very well made. I'm very impressed and I think more people should try them. Thanks to Yuva for sending them out. I'm very, very impressed. I'm super happy with them as well. And that's it for this video. Mike McIntyre, all things sports. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Till then, take care. Peace.